Okay, so um, this edit should be pretty straightforward. Um, not really a lot that needs to be done. So <clears throat> I do notice, however, there is some kind of color cast here. Uh, it looks like a cyan color cast. So I'm going to play the Bye Bye Cyan on here first, and that's just going to get rid of that color cast there. Now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to pop the whites. Um, I'm going to bring it down just a tiny bit because again with that one you want to make sure that it's not washing out your board here. Um, and you'll know like how dark this wood is. I'm just making a pretty good um, guess just based on um, what I have here. And I'm actually going to take the black though um, because this area of the image is a little bit more um, overexposed than the rest of the image. So I'm going to actually brush it down a little bit over um, over this and bring it back here a little bit. Um, it help if my brush is at lower opacity. Okay. Um, so just trying to like even out the lighting a little bit. Now I'm going to go down to paint off shadows. And I'm going to paint and white over this area of the sign and down here, especially where the shadows are a little darker. I'm going to paint on light. looking pretty good. Now I am just going to um, go to white and whites and I'm going to brush over the whites here just to brighten those up a little bit more. And um, finally what I'm going to do is I'm going to add make a levels layer and what this does is it creates a levels layer and we can go to um, view or sorry windows and then properties and that's going to open up the um, the levels and what we want to do is we want to pull in um, and add a little contrast here um, where the histogram falls flat we're just pulling that in you can see it just added a little bit of subtle contrast to the wood there because that was looking a little washed out. And now the final thing I'm going to do is play crisp finish. Um, and that's just, that just really sharpens up the edges of, um, of the product and it really makes that wood grain um, pop out. So that is all I would do there. I'm going to go ahead and these and group them. So here's the before and here's the after.